Hello everyone, thanks for tuning in. I'm Emily, the home bookkeeper, and on this channel, I help business owners and fellow freelance bookkeepers navigate the ever-changing QuickBooks Online, while also sharing insightful videos on all things business ownership and finance. As always, this is a sample company provided by QuickBooks for educational purposes only. In today's video, I will be reviewing how to set up your product and service settings in QuickBooks Online. This is the accountant view of QuickBooks Online for my fellow home bookkeepers. If you are a business owner, please feel free to check out my QuickBooks Online tutorials for business owners playlist for a better view of what QuickBooks Online will look like for you. First, you'll want to head over to the gear icon in the top right corner of your dashboard and under your company, select account and settings. Once inside, enter the sales tab. Once in the sales tab, you'll scroll down and enter the products and services section to edit those settings. Here you can select if you wish to show products and services columns on sales forms, add SKUs, you can turn on price rules, track quantity and price rates, and track your inventory. When you have your personalized settings selected, click on the green save button and when finished, click the green done button to close out the settings. Now over on the side toolbar, enter the sales screen. Once in the sales screen, click on the products and services tab. Here you can see how your settings customizations affect how you are able to interact with QuickBooks Online. This is also the place where you will add new products and services as your business grows. To do so, simply click on the new button in the top right corner and complete the product and service screen. Let's go ahead and review an invoice together. Clicking on the invoices tab and scrolling down, I am going to enter this invoice here for cookies by Kathy. By selecting the invoice and clicking on the green edit button on the pop-up. Once inside the invoice, scroll down to the product and services section and you can see here the item description, quantity, rate, and amount is all filled out. This can all be automated depending on how you customize your settings and complete the new product and services screen upon setting up. Here it looks like this invoice is for a weekly gardening service at a rate of $25 per hour and it took Craig's landscaping team three hours to complete the service. Clicking on the product and service drop down, you can see that this item is categorized under a landscaping service. You can create different types of products and service groups in QuickBooks Online and organize each product or service under those groups. To edit a product or service, click on the blue text link on the far right column of the product or service you wish to edit. The edit screen is the same as the new product or service screen, making it super easy to edit all of your details. And there you have it. For more business resources, my online self-paced home bookkeeper masterclass, business supplies, gadgets, must-haves, and more, make sure to check out edjconsultinggroup.com, linked in the description box below. And of course, like this video, subscribe to my channel, and turn on those bell notifications so you'll never miss an upload. If you have any video or tutorial requests, make sure to leave them in the comments below. And for even more behind the scenes content of life as a home bookkeeper, feel free to follow me on Instagram at Emma Dawn and connect with me on LinkedIn. And if you need more assistance, 
private QuickBooks online coaching or bookkeeping and payroll management, feel free to email or visit edjconsultinggroup.com. My firm is fully inclusive and ready to help you along wherever you may be in your entrepreneurship or personal wealth building journey. 